Hello, this is Joel Lindstrom from CRM Tip of the Day. In this tip, I'm going to be comparing the CRM for Outlook Legacy plugin versus the Dynamics 365 app for Outlook, specifically the scenario of tracking and setting regarding on an email. Which one is faster? So first, I'm going to start with uh, CRM for Outlook. And I'm going to be emailing my good friend, Tip Jar. And just to mention, you can send your tips to jar at crmtipoftheday.com and send any of your tips about using CRM, administering CRM, developing for CRM, and we'll get them up on CRM Tip of the Day. Some of our best tips come from some of our readers. So I'm sending a great tip, and now I've, set, I've created my email. So now I want to set this regarding, but I want to set it regarding Tip Jar's parent company, CRM Tip of the Day. So I'm going to hit Set Regarding, click More, and then I'm going to search for CRM Tip of the Day. CRM Tip. There we go. And I'll stop the stopwatch. Now I'm going to do the same thing, but I'm going to use the Dynamics 365 app for Outlook. So I'm going to write my email to jar at CRM Tip of the Day. Great tip. And now I'm going to start the stopwatch and click on Dynamics 365. It doesn't recognize him. All I have to do is click this link and I have set regarding. Stop the stopwatch. So as you can see, the Dynamics 365 app for Outlook wins in the scenario of creating the email and setting regarding to the parent company of the of the recipient. Uh, now you may be thinking, yeah, but you now that you've tracked an email to Mr. Jar, uh, you can hit set regarding and have your recently selected regarding records here. And that is true. Um, but I would say that there are some similar usability features in the app for Outlook, uh, such as when I set regarding here, um, it gives me my recently used and pinned records. So if I have tip jar pinned there, I can very easily select him uh, very quickly. So I said, I would say that pretty much negates the, uh, both have very, very good usability and recently viewed records. I would argue that the, uh, the app for Outlook's recently viewed and pinned records feature is actually better than the legacy Outlook clients remembering what you've selected because this is specific to my machine. If I use multiple computers or if I have viewed a record inside the web client but haven't, haven't done it in Outlook, um, this won't know anything about it where this method that shares the same recently viewed records and pinned records with the other interfaces such as mobile, etc., uh, is actually preferable. So the winner in this scenario is the Dynamics 365 app for Outlook.